What's up YouTube, it's Futuber26 here, and in today's video, I'll be predicting the top 30 best German players for FIFA 21. Hope you guys enjoy the video. I saw you coming until you turned me around mm -hmm. I used to think I was nothing, but look at this love we found mm -hmm. I never really saw you coming until you turned me around What's up guys, thanks for watching my video. I'm just going to give some explanations for the top 10 ratings and why I decided to rate them the way I did. So starting at number 10, Leroy Sane has not really featured this season due to his injury and due to that fact I just kept him at a 86 and didn't really change any of his stats. At number 9, Serge Gnabry has had a really really good season. The 39 goal contributions in 46 games is really really good and that's why I gave him a plus 2 rating with some big upgrades with his passing of plus 4 and then a plus 2 shooting upgrade. Timo Werner at number 8, I decided to keep him at an 86, just give him slight 
upgrades in his shooting and his passing. He's uh, been really, really good this season. Um, he's already scored 31 goals this season, which for me has been really, really great. Then if we go to number seven, we have Thomas Muller. Um, so, so, so many assists this season. I mean, 17 so far. I think he's only behind Kevin De Bruyne. Um, for the top five leagues in Europe, he's been really, really good and I did, did decide to give him a plus one upgrade. Looking at number six, uh, we have Joshua Kimmich. He's been really, really solid, changing from right back to CDM. Um, alongside Thiago, he's been really, really great at Bayern. And that's why I did give him a plus one upgrade. Going into the number five position, Matt Summels. Um, this one is a bit debatable. He could stay at 87, um, but I do think he will go to 88. And that's why I've given him a plus one. Coming in in the number four position is Marco Royce. I kept him at an 88. Changing position from camp to center forward. I think he's had a decent season. Could possibly go down to an 87, but I do think he yeah, will keep him at an 88. Number three position, Manuel Neuer. Beginning back to his best, and I did decide to give him a plus one upgrade to an 89 rating. Number two and number one, Tony Cruz and Andre Stegen both 90, rating, 90 rated. I do think Cruz... Um, will go up to 90 rating as he has had a solid season and Stegen will stay at a 90 rating. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and check in the next one.